Oh, look at that! We got electric Pikachu. Hmm. Okay. Maybe more or less. Oh, that's pretty decent. Maybe not that. This is a usable hand, but I'm not sure if it's good enough to win. It's gonna be a long round. Yes. We start with this. Junger Wolf. Let's see who can beat me. What do you guys think? Who is the one man who can beat me in this game? Is there a deck out there that can beat Dana? So far, the answer is no. Closest is Nilfgaard. Skelliga might be a good candidate though. Well, I already have a human. Feature Neo Guard can and just ox and everything. Could be right about that. Also, Bruver is like brutal. Seems like I have my own meta. I'm not. I'm. I'm not even joking. I kind of have my own meta in mind because. The, the guys on the ladder, they have their own meta, which is spamming damage. That's not my meta. My meta is playing Dana, playing uh, uh, playing Bruver. It's like, and I'm I'm really doing uh, pretty well with them. So mostly Squirtle. Squirtle is pretty good. Who's the chip? Do I play a Puffco here? I think I... S You'll have to. I want to. I'm behind by a lot of points. But I suppose I'm maybe committing to this, no matter what. Okay. I'm behind by 22 points. I'm concerned about uh, getting pushed. Also, I played a lot of good cards round one. Seems like a usable hand round two. I'm gonna keep it. I don't like if he's gonna push me. Push me. And we're gonna go Hawker Smuggler plus whatever is appropriate. Actually, no Hawker Smuggler here. Just boost war. I'm, again, surprised. Okay, you got me round one, 
But do you really hope to win a long round three against Dana? Not good, but if we keep mulliganing here, we might find the other dwarf. Though this is not a great hand. We can kick the dwarf and try to find something better. I think most likely we're just gonna find a downgrade. So we can start and we don't have an extra Dryad in hand, so Saskia is not very valuable, but you might think that it is. Obviously we are going crazy right away. I'm just thinking what to play with it. It might be Saskia. Yeah, we go Saskia, then Smuggler. Saskia might not die. He might not have a uh, six damage here. CDPR seem more scared of NG meta than damage meta, but I have no idea why. Surely the gaming experience of two players with uh, competing engines getting crazy out of control is more fun than uh, the experience of endless damage. Deny, banish, lock. Uh, I'm not convinced about that right now because last video they made... Uh, I'm, I can't really recall exactly what they said. But... Uh, damn. I guess you just gotta watch it. Hmm. The thing is, but what speaks louder than words is that uh, they are kind of testing unit-based approaches, usually in seasonal mode. And they moved away from uh, no unit decks, and they made a limitation. I suppose that's uh, one thing that, uh, that, again, speaks very clearly here. But they do believe that this whole damage plus a dude uh, is still okay. I personally think that it's not not that okay, but... like Not like it doesn't have a place in the game, but I think it's just overrepresented. Yeah, I would like to see more control options, because the way I see it, like, if you uh, played some MMOs or RPGs or whatever, like, any other type of games, you wouldn't call killing control. That's, that's killing, like, when, when you kill something, the fight stops. It's, it's boring, it's, it's over. But, like, again, battlefield. You have a battlefield, the units go into battlefield, the armies are ever-growing, it gets more complex, the longer the round, the more intense it is. But if it's just like, hey, you played something, I killed it, you played something, I killed it, you played something, I killed it, then at the end of the game, it's like, woohoo, I got five points, you got four, you sucker! Like, yeah. I suppose... It's not the best. Uh, blowing that up is acceptable. Hey, hey, Ting. Adam, what do you think of... Uh... I, don't, I don't get political here, guys. Oh, crap.
I try to not concern myself with politics, if I can help it. Olaf. I can't blow it up, can I? It's damn close, but it's not close enough. I have seven dudes there. Wow, actually... I might want to play Barnabas, so we can... Yeah, Barnabas, Barnabas in the back. I played too many units into the uh, melee row. Now it's a little awkward. What's with the lackluster greeting? What do you want? Rip my shirt off! What the fuck? Hey, they showed up! Time to get weird, guys. Oh, finally, we got a uh, place for the Mahakam guys. Urban is a cool dude. Sure. Oh, that's a lot of points. Wish I had 8 units in the front, then we could have insta killed the bear. That would have helped. Gotta play this in the front. It's fine. What about this, yeah. Should I play this new Spellforce game? Is it any good? When did it came out? Why did I not hear about it? Don't they want me to play this game? Oh, it came out pretty recently. Very recently. Hmm. Oh. So I can play a dwarf in the back, then a then a trap. Yeah, we play a trap in the front, but not right now. We play a dwarf in the back. Actually, we can play a trap in the front. Like, it's gonna hit the front anyway. Okay, yeah, whatever. Doesn't really matter. He might actually hit the... ...spools now. I can't play guys there. It, it wasn't a terribly terrible idea playing the trap earlier because I definitely don't want to hit the last row with the skulls. Uh, eight, up to eight, seven. Let's do seven. Rip in peace, bear. Playing Gwent in 2019? Well, the, that's the only thing you guys watch! Right? <gasps> it is entirely possible that I will stream some other games as well. But I couldn't really find the time. GG. Uh, oh, well, good, good job, Skellige man. Or bear, whatever you prefer. We got a Francesca. Hmm. Let's kick one of these uh, fancy dryad ladies. I want to on their combo. I have to go first. Okay, we're kicking one of them. Not a great hand. But usable. Four points is a lot better than three. You like pizza? Holy shit! My soulmate! Oh, fuck. Um, 
I like pizza too. But I don't really like Ragnarok. At least on my head. I like I like uh causing Ragnarok. Am I really playing to the melee row now? It just seems like a very bad idea. But two of my units need to be played there. Okay. She likes removal. We gotta play one more card at least. It is possible that I'm gonna pass. I'm I'm definitely not looking forward to Ragnarok on my head last round. But it might be okay. We need a long round, and I can't really prevent the Ragnarok. Girls on the internet? Nani? No. There's no there are no girls on the internet. I've yet to see a girl on the internet. They don't exist. I'm came here because Swim is playing retarded auto chess again. <laughs> well. It makes me feel very special. So I'm I'm the runner up to swim. If he's playing auto chess. I'm surprised that uh, it got so popular. Yeah, I'm pretty popular. Uh, surprised as well. I didn't even play it. It looked okay, I guess, but I was never really like, oh, I gotta try this out. What the hell is he doing? Do I just play Pafko here? I guess we're gonna play Pafko. Adam? The hell hating. I can't even hit that. I can play this for eight. And that's it. If I want to. I don't want to though. That's gonna give me a pretty... Oh, this could be really helpful last round. I think I'm just gonna pass. Allowing him to take it. He's gonna Ragnarok my head, but... Not much I can do about it. I'm only here because Pumpkin isn't streaming. I'm really glad that you guys are so upfront about this. <laughs> God damn it. What is Swim and Pumpkin doing better than me? You guys really know how to make me feel special. I played Dota <laughs> 5,800 games right now, and I know how much chess helped Dota with additional popularity, but I cannot deny that how stupid and based on luck is this game. Pass. <clears throat> I played some Dota games too, but I'm I'm glad to say at this point I'm just Dota free and I'm not playing Dota. I'm proud to say that. Take that. There are some good cards in there. This is Okay, this is the weakest one. Yeah, that's an improvement. I only have one human. If we go Dana. We... 
We drop the band in the back. Then we follow it up with a Milva in the front. And the bear could be stupid against Ragnarok. Most likely we're gonna get Ragnarok. So we are both playing our cards instantly. Okay. Does he have more dwarves? Well, we already played a human, so we can play the other human now. Also, I don't want him to remove the Antibear. If the Antibear can somehow survive, that's gonna happen. Auto just isn't based on luck. It's like saying Mahjong is based on luck. They're just two games I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I, I kind of know about both of them. But I never played Mahjong or Auto Chess. I think we might gotta play this Dryad. We might... Do we just play in the back? Let's say no. Okay. I'm still trying to bait out some removal, plus, yeah. Fine. We played the Ant Bear. Pretty decent. Obviously, there is a strategy to it, like anything. <clears throat> I haven't played it. Random is super, uh, string. What? Super strong addictive mechanic. Uh, this is additional proof. Chess is based on luck so much. Oh my god, he stole my boar! Well, it looks like the back is just gonna die. That's not great. But in a way, I kind of traded my hero power for her hero power. So Adam, you thought about climbing but decided to Dana climb? No! Actually we are climbing! Ask the chat! We are winning. Every single game was won this, this day. Don't know if uh, my joke works. Not native English. No, I didn't get it. <laughs> Might be just dumb. The anti-bear can protect your dryads? Uh, yes! Because when it gets hit by the Ragnarok, it goes to the front. It goes down to three. Then it gets hit on the head. Then it comes back. And, well, it's, it's like every other round it takes a Ragnarok shot. That's what I'm talking about. But if you're gonna play some Deadlock Monsters, then I'm gonna be there just because of pure love. Well, do you really like that? Well, ultimately, I gotta stay true to myself. And that means no Deadlock Monsters for you. Beck is dying. Oh, 
ージをついてきて。Oh, the back is gonna die. They gonna climb? Do not climb. Joke. <gasps> Okay, I guess we play Barnabas in the back. Samun? What the hell? Uh oh, I don't like where this heading. Am I gonna get crushing trapped? Yanakatera. Oh my god! My big tree is shut down. So no matter what I do, this this trap. But it's gonna hit the front now. But if I actually hit the the back, it would be better. So if I ping this, you can actually get more value. Passing. Hit the back! Bring it on! That better be some really good card. That was a pretty good card, but not quite good enough. Look at that. He had the big dragon. What's he thinking about? I guess we found out who's better, Dana or uh, Francesca. GG. And the good news is that we are winning against everybody with a slight margin, like 10 points. That's really good.